Hey, besties. I had to go get some snacks. Hey, happy Sunday. Oh my God, my eyes are out. I'm sorry, guys. Hey. Ooh, Australia. What time is it in Australia? Let me try to put myself down. Hey, guys. I am starving. Hey. Hey, April. Y'all, my eyes. You know what? Let me, I need to put on a shirt. Wow, 10.35 a.m. on Monday. Oh, wow. Well, happy Labor Day to you. Hey, guys. In this closet, it's too hot. Happy Sunday. Hold on, guys. Okay, now look like I have some sense. <laughs> Happy Sunday. And my hair came down. Well, I'm glad you are here. Okay, so someone emailed me and they wanted me to go over my reverse monogram collection. That's why you see my bags here. And they asked for the Juliet wallet, okay? Guys, my hair is all over the place. If you guys can just come in and like the video, that's all I ask. Hey, hey, hey. Just like the video. Thank you. Hey, guys. Thank you for liking. Thank you. <laughs> you guys know I have to show these off. I am so happy about my crocs thank you guys for liking the video thank you so much i cannot wait to use these and wear them i love them so much this was so thoughtful and i cannot wait to pair it with my backpack and you guys need to invest in these little four inch, hey, these little four inch chains here. I got them linked in my Amazon storefront. And I believe you get three in a pack. And I think they're like, what, $5, $4 or $5. You guys need to invest. These are so cute. I've already, before finding this brand, I went through three. But this brand is hot, so make sure you invest. I love attaching it. I love it. My phone going off. Okay. And I just attached this here. You guys know this is a bracelet. I cannot wait to wear it with my Crocs. Okay. Hey, everybody. So I am going to quickly go over some of the questions you guys asked me about my reverse monogram collection. And also, so <laughs> I want to do the monogram, 
you know, the Money Ground Monday. But guys, we might have to hold off because Letty, you know, that's my YouTube, you know, moderator. She does so much for me and I hate to leave her out. So if she's not able to come on, I don't think I'm going to do it. I think I'm going to wait on her because she owns some property in Florida. And I think she said that they were going to go check due to the hurricane. They're going to go check on property in Florida. And so if she doesn't come on live for rehearsal, I don't think I'm going to do it. I'm going to wait on her. I just feel bad leaving her out. Hey, what's going on? So we're just going to wait. But if she doesn't show up like in about like 30 minutes, then we are going to wait. But what I want to do for a Monogram Monday, I don't care. Yes, that's what I was thinking because she's in my mindset class. And she said something. Um, that's where her hair is done at the end. I'm looking. Um, she, is start, she is going, I think, on a flight at 6 to go to Florida. So I think she's already on the flight. Neo. I had four Neo Noe's. I've sold all of my Neo Noe's. I don't like Neo Noe handbags. I had four. I sold all of them. Let me cut my phone off, my other phone. Let me do it. Yes, yeah, so I'm not... Okay, yeah, so she's checking on property in Florida. So I don't think I am going to do anything. I'm going to wait on her. Okay, I just didn't know what day. I thought it was Monday. So if it's today, so I'm not going to leave Letty out. Like, honestly, she helps me out so much. She is just, she's been such a blessing to me and I don't want to leave her out. But what I want to do for our first Monogram Monday if you have more than one monogram speedy you guys know i have the nano the nano speedy i have the speedy 20 and i also have the speedy 25 okay so i'm gonna wait on her if you have more than one speedy i want you to show that okay for monogram monday not this monday because we don't have lady with us so next week hey hello so i'm gonna start with because I received like 12 messages about the Juliet wallet. I don't know why everybody's still going crazy over the Juliet wallet. This came out with three years ago, three or four years ago. I think three years ago. So this is a Juliet wallet, guys. And I'm going to be honest, I haven't used this yet. <laughs> I haven't used this yet. So here is the beautiful Juliet wallet. Gold hardware is still shiny, still beautiful front pocket right here okay a lot of you guys asked you thought this was just for decor but this is a front pocket so you can put your driver's license here you can put i think it's getting popular oh it's getting back popular okay so well it's three years old so it, a lot of people have been asking me to go over it uh-uh i'm not selling this no no way i'm not selling this so a lot of people was asking is this a front pocket yes it is a front pocket so you can put your cards here opening it you have additional card slots okay yes i love this but i'm so stuck on my browser wallet i just keep i have so many cards i don't carry cash so i have so many cards and the browser wallet holds everything like Honestly, everything I need, the Brazza wallet, it does the, it does a trick. It does everything. So I don't switch because usually when I switch, I always leave something behind. And it's always something that I need at that moment. So I just condition myself to just stick with the Brazza wallet. But I'm not getting rid of this at all. And so it has card slots here. And look at this. I got something in here. Y'all, didn't I tell you? I've been looking for, oh my God. This is a credit card I've been looking for. Let me take that out. Oh my God. I'm going to go over everything you guys asked, but let me get through this. The whole loop gem in reverse monogram. Oh yes, that's one of my favorites. I've been looking for this card. OMG. Oh, that's one of my good cards too. <laughs> so it's a pocket here. And I always reach back here thinking it's a pocket, but it's not. And 
here for cash. Flip it over. Let me see. Make sure I don't have anything. Okay. Nothing in here. Whatever that was. Nothing in here. Okay. So, yes. I do. I highly recommend. Because, it, like I said, it holds, it holds cash. Hold, it has car slots here. Additional room here. Let me see. Is this a... Okay. Yes, most definitely, okay? I love it. I really do. And it's reverse monogram, okay? No Vachetta, black leather. So I hope this helped. Like, I received so many emails. I'm going to go over. So if it's something, a bag that you need me to go over, I'm here to do that today. And then we are going to talk about a few other things as well. Yes, I love this, okay? And someone asked, where is it? Okay, so a lot of you guys, you are going back watching older videos. I see now that I have a lot of new subscribers and a new followers. I think they're coming from TikTok because I'm receiving a lot of people from TikTok that's starting to follow me now. And they are going back to old videos. This was gifted to me from my CA. I'm telling you now, when she gifted this to me, I went straight home and tried to look this up. I wanted to know how much it was. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. When she gifted this to me, I was so happy. I went home. I don't even know if I still have the product code number in here. Yes. Thank you, Toya. Oh, yes. Come on. It's a hundred. Is it a hundred? Guys, I can't tell how many. I thought it was a hundred. I thought I could see, but it just, it just went off. I don't know how many people are on here, but thank you so much, Toy. If you guys can just come in and hit the like button, that's it. So I tried to come home and look this up, but I could not find it. So I don't know how much. I can't even see the likes on my end. Thank you so much for telling them that because I can't see if people are coming in liking or not. So, it's nothing back here. I don't know. So, you guys asking me about this. I don't know. Okay. I still have the gold hardware on there. And this is it. What's up? I don't know, but I'm on live. Yeah, I, I guess so. That's fine. Oh, y'all, I got to tell you about that, too. King is trying to... This boy here. Okay, anyways. So, here it is. So you're not going to be able to find this. It was gifted to me, like I said, from my CA. I tried to find out um, how much it, how much it, how much it is, honestly, and I couldn't find it at all. And she was not trying to tell me anything. And right here, you just unscrew here. And it would be so dope if they had like a D ring here for me to attach, but. It's not. So here it is. Okay. And um, hi, are you selling your Alma PM? Which Alma PM? So you guys asked about this as well. I love this. Oh. This little cute mini. This is a vanity. And this is usually where I keep my AirPods in here. But King has my AirPods. Let me see. This made in the U.S. Okay, no. It's made in Italy. <gasps> oh, there's Letty, guys. <laughs> Letty, you got to get on these people. They not liking the video. We're going to have to get on them. We need your energy. 
Okay, so here it is. So, guys, I wouldn't buy. I said I'm not. I am not. Hey, lady. I'm not um, buying any more of these minis. No more, guys. They are getting too expensive. Okay? They are getting too expensive. So, just watch out. Thank you, Latoya. So, be careful with these. They are getting very, very expensive. Hey, Andrea. You know, class is tomorrow, so be ready. Okay, so let me go. I'm trying to make sure I get through all of this so we can do our little talk, okay? Yes, so the prices have went up. Let's see what else before I start showing the bags. Okay, so I'm going to go and start showing the bags. The first one, I'm going to tell you about this, okay? The <laughs> I am not a huge fan of the double zip pochette, but you can get very creative with the double zip pochette. I could not let this one go. And the Damier Azure, I had one, and that's the one I gave away. That one you can wear, guys, as a bum bag. You can convert this, okay? You can do so much with this. But, of course, this is a reverse monogram handbag. I'm not letting it go. Okay. Inside, I always preserve the straps. It came with a leather strap. But this is a cute, also a cute starter handbag. If you are just now getting into, you know, Louis Vuitton handbags, small crossbody handbags, holds your phone. It does have card slots in here. Yes, it can look bulky. You just can't fill it up to the max, okay? Like, this is my iPhone 14. This is the Pro. I'm on the max right now. So, you can put your phone in here. And in the front, I wouldn't put, like, a mini pochette. Just your lip gloss, hand sanitizer. Nothing real bulky to make it stick out, guys. Oh, I'm not. I wouldn't sell any of my reverse monogram handbags. Okay? I actually love that they didn't do the giant print on this side. Okay. Just sell it for the price that you paid for it. Okay. Yes, I'm telling you now, this bag, just don't stuff it because it does look very weird. I even seen people use this compartment here. Okay. They put things in this compartment right here in the middle. I'm just curious. I just wanted to see. Okay. I just wanted to see if it held my phone. I'm like, hold on a minute. So, I don't know why they do it, but I would be kind of scared to do that. But they do. And again, it comes with a leather strap. Wait a minute. I like straps like this. Okay. Okay, something just went through my head. <laughs> yes, just, just sell it for the price you pay for. You won't lose any money, okay? Gold hardware. Very cute. Okay, what's next? This is the vertical zippy wallet, okay? I love this i love it i love it i love it it didn't last long at all on the website i mean when my ca sent me a text message she was like marquita this is gonna go i was like you say that about every handbag she was like no this is going to go and it went and you cannot find it hardly unless you go i've seen it on fashion Fall, I think Fashion Fall was selling this for $2,700. $2,700. That's crazy. That's insane, okay? So, and it still has the plastic on. 
Okay, lady, be careful, lady. You don't you don't have to stay on live. I appreciate you always being here, lady, but your safety is important. No, none of my handbags are for sale. My reverse monogram, no. I'm only showing because I received, I'm finally trying to get through my emails and everybody's asking about reverse monogram, my collection. So I'm going to show it here live. Hopefully this helps because I get to talk about it and go into detail versus doing a YouTube video where it's just super long. So here it is, microfiber material, black interior. And this is where, y'all, I'm trying to be, like, so calm right now. But King, my son, he doesn't have school tomorrow. And he just, like, he's throwing a party or something. And a sleepover party. I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to stay calm. But this boy, is he just went to the park and invited all his friends. Oh, man, bro. I, I I don't know what to do with him. Okay, so that, that closed. Okay, so this is the front. Let me make sure I don't have any cards in here. Okay, so here it is. Okay, so you see my phone is here. And this is the only part I hate. So I'm trying to make sure, because you know once that canvas starts bending, you have to be careful. Yes, he, this boy throwing a whole sleepover party. I mean. Okay, so compartment back here for your cash. Here, you have the car slots. Right here, you can put items in and then you have the mid compartment. I will show you, I have a speedy. Yes, guys. This boy, I got to tell you what else. I got to tell you what my daughter did. And I got to tell you what he did. What King did. Oh, my God. Y'all. Okay, you have a good day, too. And on the opposite side, more car slots. Okay. He's throwing a party for himself his asthma he's fine now if he's throwing a party he's not even worried about his asthma and guys it comes with a chain strap and here's the d-rings here so you wear it as a crossbody y'all these kids be kicking my butt man and i got the the chain is on my other bag Oh yeah, no, I know all the fr I know the friends that he's going to invite. It's just a simple fact. I'm like, you know, tomorrow you're out of school. I have my mindset class early in the morning. I just I don't want to deal with any kids right now. I don't want to deal with my own right now. Like, oh, come on. <laughs> okay, so here it is. The vertical zippy wallet. I will contact my CA to see if cuz you know they are bringing items back. Okay, but on Fashion Fall, this was not $2,700. I forgot how much I paid for it, but it wasn't $2,700. So be careful with the prices. Okay, what else is next? You know what? I keep forgetting the name. I keep forgetting the name of this bag. I keep forgetting the name of this bag. But when I tell you, this was the first for me expensive handbag i went from a never full my never full being i think fourteen hundred dollars thirteen hundred dollars to three thousand i think it was thirty five hundred dollars i was like hold on wait a minute now <laughs> wait a minute so now th these are the real prices okay i getting kind of expensive but i forgot the name of this handbag Ugh. That's it. I don't know why I want to call it a soft trunk. Okay. Yes. Trunk clutch. This, um, uh, this was my first expensive to me handbag. I think it was like $3,500 then. I don't, I don't remember, but I just know I was like, Ooh, crazy. <laughs> oh, I already got gray hair. I just dyed my hair. The gray hair is there. 
So, guys, look at this. <laughs> when I say I got my money's worth, honey, I got my money's worth. Look at that. That's why I tried to protect my gold hardware. That's that's crazy. That's crazy. And look at the leather. But this is, what, five years old. So, it's five years old. It's been doing its thing. Shrub. And here is the inside. Mine most definitely isn't in good condition, but it's in good use condition for me because I use my handbag. <laughs> and it's, guys, no Vachetta. That's why I love reverse monogram so much. I love the black leather. I love it. Y'all, I am really, like, heated inside. This boy, I'm just wondering how many kids coming over. Like, I don't even know how many kids coming to my house. Like, that's crazy, okay? And with the S-lock at the front. I love how much, you guys know I love gold hardware, so. Okay. We went over that. And here is the cans. This is one of, of my husband's favorite reverse monogram handbags in my collection. He loves creative handbags, different handbags. It took me a while, not a while to honestly fall in love with it, but I was kind of worried with how it would lay as a crossbody. But once I got it, I was like, I don't even use the crossbody strap. I just use it as a tote. You guys know I love top handles. And so wrapping a bandeau around the top handle was everything to me. And I love how they have the added lock on here. It's just the details like this is an amazing handbag and look at the gold feet at the bottom lb took their time they took their time this was well thought out this is so unique so creative and beautiful and i love how they flatten the the back so it can honestly lay on your side if you decide to use it as a crossbody okay so here it is here's the d-rings the D-rings, okay? Very cute and... Oh, man, I knew I was going to have some stuff in here. It's some gum, some trash, and a quarter. <laughs> okay. And this is... I have an organizer inside. No, my husband called me... And he was like, did you know anything about so-and-so, you know, these kids spend the night? And I'm like, no. He was like, well, the parents are calling me asking when they should come over and what time. I'm like, what the heck? So here it is. And so I was just like, whatever, you know. I'd rather them come to my house than King go to their house. Because I can, I know, I love kids. I really do. And I just don't really trust people with my kids. <laughs> so... Yes, the organizer is from Swag My Bag Accessories. So here it is. Guys, this is so cute. So cute. Okay. Yes, I don't really... I don't even think King... He's 13 and I don't even know if he's spending the night at someone's house. Yes, it, it's, with, it's a black strap. I don't know if I have it on a vanity or what. But it does come with a strap. You guys know I, I play around with all of my straps. Let me see. Guys, I have so many straps over here. It's insane. I'm over here looking like, where are my straps? Let me see what this is. I think another video, I'm going to show you guys my straps. No, this don't go together. I don't know. Let me see. I'm dropping crap. Like, you can add any strap. I just reach for a strap. This is kind of thick for this handbag. Where's my other one? Let me see. 
Okay, so you see how this is the reverse monogram strap? Y'all, I got stuff everywhere. I have straps. I got to show you guys my strap collection. I'm going to show you my straps, and I'm also going to show you my belt collection and my bando collection, okay? Because I'm getting ready for the fall. So you see how, you see this reverse monogram strap? You see the end? This is from another handbag strap. I don't know which one it's from. So this is what I do. You see that? And I just do this. And you see that? One side is monogram and then one side is reverse monogram. Did I even do that right? Okay. But I don't want it that long. Let me see. Let me shorten it. I'm going to shorten it some. But I just sometimes just play with these straps to get what I want, the look that I want. Okay? So there it is. And I just add it on the bag. But this is going to be extra long. So this will probably be for my tall divas. But you see how one side I have reverse monogram and then the other side I have monogram. So, but I believe this came with like a black leather strap. So, I take straps from all of my handbags and I take them off and do what I want with them. I'm going to put that right there. Or you can put this on. So many different ways. Just get creative. If you feel like that's too much reverse monogram, just go to a monogram. Okay. So this is the Cans handbag. The next handbag. I need to cut my phone off. Okay. So this is the beautiful, I have something in here. This is the beautiful Vanity PM, and this is why I have the baby, okay? And this is another handbag that my husband loves. You see the gold hardware at the bottom. I just love everything. This is so creative. These top handles, LV, really did their thing, honestly. I have to give it to them. And the double zipper. I just love how soft this is and just, it's so creative. Honestly, I love it. Okay, and here's a strap. I am such a fan of the leather and chain straps. Such a fan. Okay, let me show you the inside. Here's the inside. Now I check to make sure all of my bags, <laughs> where all of my bags. Okay, this is Italy. You guys know I love the microfiber material and it has a side pocket for the card. Let me see. Does this have a price? No. That's just a card that comes with it. But here it is. Very cute. Very unique. And let me put the strap on so you guys can see. And it's so soft. Okay. And it has that lock that's attached to it. Okay. Okay. It's attached to it. But you can. It does come with the key, but it's somewhere. I don't know, but you can take this off. <laughs> I'm checking all my bags now. Okay? Y'all, these little kids calling the phone. Whew. I'm finna have a house full of kids, man. I ain't even set this up. Man, that's forcing me to go. I'm going to have to go buy a Shipley's Donut in the morning. Here it is. 
Okay, now this is sexy, guys. This is super sexy, okay? And, of course, you can take this bag tag off. If, it, if you feel like it's just irritating there on the front, you can take it off. So, this is how it looks without it. And again, that's why I was telling you how it lays flat here. That means LV was really, really thinking. Like, they really put in work. Oh, they not getting no taco cabana, girl. They can get some hot dogs. They gonna get some hot dogs, chips, fries. They not gonna do nothing but just go tear up the house. <laughs> Upstairs. Okay. So here that beauty goes. And guys, I love the Palm Springs Mini. Oh my God, I love this so much. It does come with black leather straps. This is a backpack. If you guys have been following me, you guys know I don't use this as a backpack. It's either a tote handbag. I tie a bando around this leather part here. Okay. Here's the bag. The front, very beautiful. And I hardly utilize this front part. I'll probably put like my hand sanitizer in here. But it does have the front compartment. Oh no, baby. I be watching them, them kids. Um, they not gonna steal. Even if they look like they steal, they better go, they gonna go back home. Okay, so uh, let me see something. Does this come with? Okay, I was like, does this come with the two zippers? <laughs> but the zipper is right here. I had to go and double check. Okay. So if you have both in your collection, which one is your favorite? If you have both. Both of them are carefree. No bachetta. Let me know. I just heard King come in. Okay. So let me open oh. it up. I'm on live, King. You better wait. So you just playing you a sleepover, huh? I asked you. You didn't ask me anything. Oh, but I asked you. When you asked me, King? I already texted you. King, you text me. Did I respond? Oh, my phone had went dead. Your phone went dead. So. What made you think I said yes? Oh, I thought you were because it's pressed. Bruh. Bruh. You gonna say no? I'm not gonna say no now, but. No, 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 we could. If, if you want to. I'm just saying, like. Bro, I'm on live. Alright. All right. <laughs> just let him. Just go, King. Just go. That's cool. It's cool? Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, it's cool. Pressing on Isaiah? You pushing it, bro. Isaiah, please. Isaiah. Which one is Isaiah? No. Uh-uh. Which one is Isaiah? The big one. King. Bro. Let me get. Let me get. And you put all them clothes in that washing machine. You did not separate them. I told you don't. Oh, yeah. Wait, Quit messing with my washing machine. Okay, bye, King. I'm on live. You it's finna done. give me, you finna stress me out, bro. It's cool? Yeah, King. Only two. It's oh. Y'all, I'm telling you, this is real life. Yes, I didn't want him to say the big one. I feel. <laughs> oh, y'all got it. I'm telling you, this is real life over here. Gosh, wait till I tell y'all what my daughter did. Okay, so <laughs> here's the inside. I'm sorry, guys. I, I try to have a regular live. You know, I don't want you guys thinking that I have a crazy house. I really don't. I don't want you guys thinking it's not, you know, it's not structured. But sometimes <laughs> he gets out of hand. <laughs> he put all of his clothes in the washing. I don't play about my appliances, guys. I don't play about my appliances. And he put 
every color of the rainbow in the washing machine. Every color of the rainbow that he had. Some things were clean. I told him to clean his room. He just dumped everything in the washing machine. Bruh. I'm sorry, guys. I, I don't, I don't, they always wait till I get on live to do this stuff to me. I don't know. But anyways, how many are coming? It, it was, it was one, then it was two, and then he said the big one. And the big one, I, that's the snack eater. So, that's the snack eater. So, I don't know what I'm going to do. I just got groceries. But it's textile material inside and then pocket here. So. I know it is. I know it's going to be more. I know. So. Like we had 14. For, for his birthday, we had 14 in the house. A sleepover of 14 boys. And it was three days. It was Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and they they didn't want to go home. Yes, guys. That's the one he eats. He eats the snacks, man. He eats the snacks. Like, he eats the snacks. And they always wait until I go to bed. I tell them to go to bed, and they wake up. They wake back up. They don't even go to sleep. They just wait till we go to sleep, and then they go and eat the snacks. So, yeah, I don't, oh man, I just, oh, y'all pray for me. No, you're supposed to eat the snacks. You are not supposed to swallow. I mean, constantly just swallow. You eat Take your time. You eat and then you go play and then, you know, maybe you come back three or four hours later. You don't swallow like, oh, that's what I'm dealing with. That's that's the big one. He it's a difference. Like you guys really don't understand. No, they're not hungry. Like we feed them like I kept feeding, kept feeding, kept feeding. But it's only one that does that. It's one. One. Like, I'm like, okay, you guys. I did nachos. I mean, loaded nachos. My husband barbecued. They had hot dogs, hamburgers, nachos. This was one meal. One meal. They had barbecue and nachos. And then a snack. It was... No, you guys don't understand. Yes, but it's only one that eats like that. <laughs> so <laughs> he has food at his, at his house. If he said that's the the big one, what is he? What's he eating? He's a growing boy, but you know what? I love him because he protects my son. As far as football, he's on the line, so he protects my son. So. Here is the Palm Springs Mini. So you guys see how I added this on here? If you feel like this is too much reverse monogram, take this off. You guys, start investing into these straps here. These bandolier straps, invest in these ban bandolier straps, okay? Where is the other one? Please invest. Let me switch it. This is the best bandolier strap. You see how much it adjusts? They need a reverse monogram like this, okay? Tall Divas. Tall Divas. You, you guys need this strap. Yes, but I wouldn't change it, guys. I love those boys. I play a lot with them. They know. They know Miss Great House. I love those boys. And that's why they all want to come over here because... I just let them be boys. I just let them be boys. And like I said, I, I feel safe with King being here anyway. 
and I love kids, so I don't have no problem with them. And I make sure I have enough snacks, so I just went grocery shopping. I do every Sunday. I grocery shop every Sunday. So, I just love kids, period. Yeah, and I try to control it here. I let them get snacks, you know, like ice cream. Like you said, they are boys. They go out in the backyard, and they just play football. They come in, play the game, and so they come in, they have ice cream, you know, they drink their water, you know, lemonade, whatever they want. So, I'm okay with it. I'm just really joking. I joke around with them a lot, too. I am going to try that. The Pacific Chill perfume, I want to try that. Okay, it looks better with this strap. This was too much. I think this is it. I do. I really do. I just love kids, like I said, period. They know Miss Miss Greyhouse love to play, and I love to joke with them. Okay, so the next, let's do this. Okay, so the other one, the monogram was a better looking strap. I thought so too. So here it is here. The beautiful Pachemites. You guys know I had some glazing issues and some peeling and I'm not going to lie, I've been watching this handbag, making sure I don't see any more peeling. So far, so good. Okay, so far. I had a little bit of peeling here. And I had some peeling here. Guys, the Pachet Matisse, I don't know why y'all don't have that handbag in your collection. I don't know what's going on with you, with you guys. But this is a bad mama jama. You guys need it. So, you know, the bag zipper compartment. Okay. This is where I keep my phone. Okay. Keep my phone in there easy access okay easy access tote handle you can tie a bandeau here do i have a bandeau if i had a bandeau i would have did it for you guys have i ever showed you guys how i tie a bandeau you sold your what okay look at that gold hardware Look at the gold hardware. If I have time, I'll go over a few of my fragrances as well. The gold hardware, not one scratch. It is no plastic. Good job. Okay. Opening up. I knew I was going to have some in there. Okay. This is the price. Okay. So, guys, do you ever worry about this? Do you see that right here? That's from the handle. You see what I'm talking about? That's from the handle here. I don't know. I watch everything. Okay. So here. Yes, you are welcome. The Poche Matisse is such a wonderful handbag to have. So this bag compartment, guys, and it's so deep. OMG. Look at that. What's my phone? Or you can just turn it sideways. Here. What is that? Oh, I got a mark in there. Guys, and you know how to clean the inside. I need to clean that. Get some water wipes. And you see that stain right there? I don't know what that's from. Get some water wipes on the microfiber material and it'll go away. Okay? It'll go away. Let me see how much I paid for this. How much did I pay for this? Wow. $1,780. How much is a Pachet Matisse now? You can't see it. It's faded now. $1,780. I know it's a lot more. I know it is. And I love keeping these. I love keeping these. What? 
$2,500. Insane. Okay, and the front compartment here. Somebody who said a Bible bag? <laughs> okay. I love it. I love my Bible bag, okay? Here it is. And this comes with the reverse monogram strap, okay? So you guys see how I played around with the strap? You can still do the same here. You can add a thicker strap. I love this tote. Let me see. Do I even have it? Or... Let me see here. Oh, yeah. This is it. This is beautiful. I don't see how you guys don't like this handbag. You guys are missing out. Too cute. Okay, what's next? Oh, okay. So, this is my least favorite. My least favorite. Okay, I can't see in the canvas version. Oh, my God. I sold my unprint leather version. No, I went in the store. I wanted black, but at that time, they didn't have any black. And so, I bought the pink and I sold the pink. I didn't like it. Whew, I only keep this. Only keep this because it's reverse on the ground. These straps are so annoying. OMG. And they're not detachable. No, I wouldn't sell, guys. Don't ever sell any of your monogram straps. They come in handy. I would never sell any monogram straps ever. And I have four. But they're all different lengths. Lengths. No, I have four and I'm not selling any of them. Because I love taking them apart. And you see how I made that mini bum bag into a bum bag with the monogram strap? It's because I was taking from different handbags. Okay, so the only reason I don't like the strap, yes. And when I put it in my, you know, in the closet up, it sticks out. Because I really can't bend these. Okay. So I will go over it. You can carry it as a tote, but you are forced to use it as a backpack. Okay. Okay. Double zipper. And it also has a zipper compartment here in the front. Well, when I bought this, I really liked it. <laughs> That's why I bought it. <laughs> okay, so here it is. And this is the front compartment. This front compartment is a lot bigger, of course, than the mini backpack. And plenty of room. Yeah. Like, this was my first backpack ever. This was my first backpack before even the Palm Springs Mini. And so, with me being, you know, a sports mom, my kids being in sports, this was perfect for me. But as time went on, it was just hard for me to even place it in my closet. And the straps are just huge. So, for that person that asked me, why would I buy a handbag I don't like? Um... It wasn't, I liked it at first. As you start to use your handbags, you know, you start to find different things and that was the thing. It was just too bulky. Other than that, that's it. If this was detachable, then I would like it. As of right now, it's going to sit in this collection because I love reverse money ground. Okay. Inside, I do have an organizer. Take it out. Yes, I am a sports mom, so it was easier for me. So here it is. See? Sports mom. <laughs> An interest ticket. And I love um, sneaking snacks in. You guys know this if you know me. And it does have a back compartment. And guys, don't get me wrong. This backpack holds a lot of items, okay? Let me see. Okay. 
Okay, I was just trying to see how long. Okay, it holds a lot of items, guys. So the backpack, that's the only reason because of the strap. Other than that, I have no issues. It's reverse monogram. It's carefree, black leather, double zipper, gold hardware. The perfect backpack minus the straps. And of course, the straps, they are adjustable. It's just that it's not it's not detachable. <clears throat> Swag my bags, guys. I sell I sell this. Yes, it does. It holds all the snacks. Okay. And the organizer has two front compartments, zipper here has a compartment here and two compartments up here and you put it in and out you can put it in and out okay i have two more bags to go over So you only have the bum bag? Yes, it's swag my bag accessories. Swag my bag accessories. Okay. Here's the next. Oh man, there's so much I can say about the on the go tote. You guys know I love this. I love it so much. But if you have the GM size, you are the winner. You are the winner. I love, love the on the go tote in reverse monogram. I think they did perfect with this. A lot of people hate the giant monogram. I love how they mix the giant monogram with the smaller monogram print on the side. This is a perfect handbag. I love the detail. You see how they did the reverse monogram here and then the monogram on this side? I love that. And the red interior. The red interior. Oh my God. They they did their, their thing on this. The black leather, you guys know, this actually came, the first release, it came with monogram straps, okay? It came with monogram straps. And so I really wasn't just into like the reverse monogram then. And so I missed that drop. And so when they came back out with this handbag, guys, these were so hard to get. OMG, these were so hard to get. When they came back out with them, they added the black leather straps, okay? But the inside, look at that red. Look at that red. <sighs> Thank you so much, Letty. This is amazing. This is this is amazing. Okay. And I always got something in here. Let me see. Okay. The price isn't on here, just the product code number. I love keeping these in my handbags. Okay. Let me see. I always like to see how long. Guys, you see how you see how deep that pocket is? You see how deep that pocket is. Look at that. Let me see if I can zip it with the phone in. I always look at that. I love deep pockets. Guys, look how deep that pocket is. And I forgot to show you, it has two pockets here. As I go through these bags, it makes me fall in love with these bags even more. Okay, so the two pockets. And then a zipper. Guys, this is just sexy. When I say boss bag, when you walk in with this bag, <sighs> boss bagging, okay? Boss bagging. And let me close it. And do you guys use your closure here? <gasps> you just scored a mini bum bag, yay! I don't use my closure. I don't use that. Okay. And so I do add a strap. And it's just for decor, okay? 
I just add this for decor. I'm gonna show you. Okay, let me put my leg up. Make sure. Add the strap. You see? Then I bring it around. Okay, you see? I hate when the LVs, I hate when the LVs are upside down like that. <laughs> I try not to, let me see if I can change it. Okay. There it is. This is only for decor, okay? But you can use it, but I just like having it on there. My LV boxes, um, I put things in them right now they're in my attic or I sell them. So here it is. And who was that said they scored a mini bum bag? We got a party. So guys, it's just to add creativity, add some spice to it. I don't use this strap with this bag, okay? So before you guys ask, and then I just add this bag charm here. Okay. Too cute. But this red, oh, this red is amazing. Okay. Oh my God, guys. I've been on here an hour. Oh, I wasn't supposed to be on here that long again. I keep saying that. Okay. So I'm doing perfect timing. I have one more bag. Okay. Last bag. Debating between a never full and an on the go tote. Okay, April, it depends. If you need it for work, take the never full. Okay. Here it is. Whew. When I tell you, I'm not a speedy 30 type of chick, but this was an exception. There's no way I was going to pass on a reverse monogram speedy. I don't, I, we don't know when the next time we are going to get a reverse money ground speedy. And the prices is insane. The prices are insane. Okay. So let me, but they could have did better. I should have designed this. They could have done better. This should have been like the on the go tote. Okay. The giant LV is just, no. And it should have been with black leather. This is treated Vachetta, okay? This is treated Vachetta. And of course, no extended zipper, which is fine. Okay. And here it is. Here's the strap. I'll put the strap on. What do I have in here? I don't know. Got some from USPS. Okay, so here's the inside. Y'all, I got so much stuff in here. What is it? Let me clean these bags out. Okay, so let me take the organizer out. Oh, yeah. When you had the chance, you most definitely should have, should have got it. Okay, and it has a baseboard. I have a baseboard inside. Yes, I have a I have luggage as well. So let me take the baseboard out. This is to stop it from slouching. You see, I don't like that look. This is the look I don't like. So that's why I keep a baseboard. When I put that baseboard in there, that's what I like. I like a structured handbag. You see how right here, because the organizer is not inside. So if I had the organizer inside, it would show a much fuller look. But with that baseboard, it doesn't have that slouch. You see how it stops right here? So I'm going to take the baseboard out. This is the baseboard from Swag My Bags Accessories. And when you take the baseboard out, you see? No, 
It'll be it'll be too much room inside. Y'all, I cannot stand this look. Okay, I showed you guys. I gotta put my baseboard back in because that irritates me so bad. I can't do it. <laughs> well, let me show you the inside first. Okay, so here's the inside. It's black textile. It's not the smooth microfiber material that I like. And you guys see me trying to open. That's why we should have extended zippers. So it is two zippers. It's not extended, guys. You hear my dog because the kids are here. Okay, and this pocket, side pocket, should have been wider. This is just my opinion, okay? And, oh my gosh. Look how short. You know what? Hey, Rich Lux. I love you. It should have been deeper, guys. This is short. It's not. Oh my God. I never use that. It doesn't make a big, it's not a big deal, but that's just crazy. That's crazy. Let me see something. Look. Guys, that is not deep. This bag is too big for that pocket to be so short. You know what? I'm returning this bag. I, I'm returning this bag. I don't care if it's four years old. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm not. Let me put my baseboard back in. Okay, I'm putting my baseboard back in. You see that? Automatically, it's gone. Let me put that dog. Oh, man. These kids is going to get on their dog's nerves. I love it. Okay, so here it is. Perfection. Perfection. I love. Perfection. Okay. So cute. So bossy. You don't hear the dog? I think she ran up there and attacked the kids. She's attacking the kids right now. They love her. Okay. So this is everything. We just need a speedy 20. And we need a bum bag in reverse monogram. Guys, and this is my reacher. This is how I reach my bags. Because I'm so short. This is how I reach for my bags. You see it? And I pinch my husband's butt. He gets so mad. I pinch his butt with this. <laughs> Too much information, but I'm just letting you know. That's what I do. When he walks by. Yes, the dog attacking the kids, and I just let her. That's a part of the entrance. You have to get attacked by the dog. Yes. He'll walk by, and I'll just come from nowhere. Or I'll wait, and i just grab his butt. <laughs> Oh man. So that's all of my reverse month grandpa. I need help. I do. And why is right here? This is <laughs> one of my luggage right here. And this is from the men's collection. But I could not pass. I could not pass on this. I couldn't pass. I love it so much. See the silver hardware. The men collection is so hot. Yes, that's the butt pincher. <laughs> okay. Oh, I look, I know. King. The King, I'm going to get you. Love it, love it, love it. Okay? This is a 50. This is a 50. Okay? The men collection, super dope. 
super duper dope. And I had this stuffed. Thank you, King. <laughs> Yes, please look at the men collection. I always go to the men collection. This is the lock. And the first drop, I missed the first drop. And I told my CA, I said, do whatever, do whatever to find me this keep all. Do whatever. I don't care what you have to do. Please find me this keep all. And <laughs> I swear, in two weeks, she said, Marquita, I found one. I found one. And she said, you want to get this now. She said, you want to get this now. It's too many people that's, that's waiting on it. Baby, I've never had her slide a card so fast. Okay. Just look at the detail. amazing and the strap like this is insane insane this released in 2020 i believe in 2020 i believe that was it was so hard oh my god it was so this was so hard when they showed this on instagram people went crazy like they made them cas work it, it was it was insane guys insane okay and this is my husband's this is his carry-on this is discontinued y'all hear that it's the apple tag going off but this is my husband's um i think this is a zag backpack why is this apple why is that apple tag going off I'm just going to keep it in here. You see, he has his earphones from the flight still in here. But. This is it. This is his carry on. Okay. And so I have more. Um, Ugh. And this is the Horizon Soft 55. And I have this stuffed. Oh, what is in here? I have this stuff, guys. <laughs> I'm sorry. I like to keep the shape. It was some socks in there too. So here it is. No, but guys, this got caught in rain. You see the inside? And I don't know what happened, but look at my tag. But I don't care. Like with my Bachetta pieces, what I am learning, because this look. Like, it was horrible. But do you see how the patina is coming in and it's kind of evening out? I don't trip on my Bachetta pieces anymore. Like, I have water spots on my Pochette Matisse, the monogram and Bachetta. And, guys, as the patina is setting in and coming in, it's like it's honestly doing its own thing, its own work. So, a lot of you guys ask me about Apple Guard. No, I don't, I don't trip. I don't trip on any of that stuff at all i just let this bag let these bags do whatever they're going to do i try to prevent it from getting water spots but if i am caught in rain like i said i'm in houston texas it can be burning up hot and then it'll just rain i don't i don't baby these handbags 
I use my handbags, okay? So a lot of you ask me, how do I treat, how do I clean them? Water wipes. That's it. If you see me cleaning anything, it's with water wipes. That's it. I take care of my bags because I don't constantly use the same bag over and over again. Yes, it's the, girl, this had some socks in there. This had everything in there. But I think this is from when we traveled to Cancun. A lot of stuff was still left in here. We didn't unpack because my husband's sweater, everything was still in there. Yes, I am really starting to, um, the baby water wipes. Yes, unscented. And guys, it works like a charm. It really, really does. I didn't believe it at first. And then when I actually purchased and I started cleaning, you see a big difference. Especially around um, the gold hardware. Because when it starts to tarnish, and let me tell you something. Don't do this. My CA taught me this. Don't leave your straps on your handbags. Because you will start to see it discolor. Because of the rubbing. Don't leave your straps on the D-rings. Take them off. When you guys see me do, when I show you a handbag, do you all, do you see how I take the straps from the inside? Take your straps off, fold them up, roll them up, put them inside of your hand bags. Don't. Don't leave them on because they do rub guys and it's and it tarnished very very quick okay and i even wipe these as well with the water wipes my ca taught me that i've been doing that for three years so do not leave your straps on so every time you see me you see that i take the straps from the inside of my bag i don't leave my straps on that's why i created this i had this created you guys see that you can't see it because it's Guys, that is crazy. I need to fix this. <laughs> this is crazy. But that's why I had this built in. Okay? I have it on both sides. And these are all my straps. Y'all see this? This is still for sale. But these are my straps. And... Hang those straps up. Hang your belts up. Don't leave them attached. That's why I go through and I take my stuff off. And when my CA showed me that, I saw a big difference. Okay. And I have more. I just store my bags on my shelves in my closet. You take the straps off. Let me show you. Because my CA, she said they even spoke on this in a meeting. And so they are supposed to tell us this stuff. She told me this three years ago. It tarnished. Because if you keep the straps on there, it will start to tarnish on this D-ring. And it'll start, take, um, it'll start turning black. Okay? So just take your strap off. Either hang your strap up in your closet if you do have a space or fold it up and place it inside of your handbag. Yeah, and a lot of people say these are heavy, but they're not to me. Yes, always. And no, don't put your handbags, keep your handbags out of the dust bag because they sweat. My CA told me a story that a young lady handbag, and then if you don't have a humidifier, if you don't have your closet built out, to store handbags if you want them to stay in your dust bag don't do it because your dust bag especially the canvas it can sweat and once it starts to sweat my ca say that builds mold mold guys you can build mold like mold can grow from the inside of your handbag due to it sweating on the out which one trying to buy what so just be careful okay very careful keep those straps off i forgot to tell you guys that i need to do a whole like video on that okay so i'm trying to see what else to show you guys i basically showed you all of my reverse monogram yes i, I try to teach you guys something new every every time i get a chance okay every time 
no do not keep your oh heck no do not keep the no 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 and your ca is supposed to tell you that your ca is supposed to tell you that okay yes it can it just depends on your closet space like it can either dry it out or guys they can sweat or they can sweat i'm trying to see what else before i get off this live that i can show you guys um i already showed you guys my boots i already showed you guys my boots um i think most of you guys saw this handbag already I still need to put this to use. Oh my God, I feel so bad. I still need to put this to use. I feel so bad. I feel so bad. Yes, please be careful. I don't know what I can use this for. This is, I don't know. My Palm Springs meaning to get the mini bum bag. What do you think? The oh, that's a good one. The Palm Springs mini. You know what? While you are right here, before I get off, let me see. <sighs> My dog is just going crazy. Okay, so you know what? It's supposed to be only, only. <laughs> Oh, baby, you just wait a minute. You going to see that. Um, Yes, most definitely. I love these. I am still trying to get the silver, but my CA cannot find the silver. They are always out of stock online. And so I might just get the uh, silver ones from Fendi. Put D rings on. Yes, I have the converter, but I don't know. I've I've done that. I already converted it. I even sell them. I have the converter, and I have the gold chunky chain, but I don't know. No, take them out. Okay, so before I get off of here, okay, you guys know I love talking to you, but I have to get prepared. I have a class in the morning that I have to be up and ready for at six a.m. But let me show you where it is. Okay. So, she wants to... Maybe you guys... Let me take this off. I don't want any distractions. Let me take this off. I don't want any distractions. And guys, again, this is a bracelet. Here it is. So you want to sell your Palm Springs mini. Hold on. What'd she say? Fake jewelry. You know what? I've been letting her make it all live. What's that woman? Who was that that said something about fake jewelry? Because I've been letting her make it all live. Who is that? Come back up. Because I've been wanting to get her so bad. What? Where's the woman? She said something about the fake jewelry. Where she at? Cause she been tripping all lot. Girl, if you don't what she said. Okay, let me get back. Let me get back to my live. Let me get back to my live. Let me get back to my live. Cause she said something. I think she was talking about the earrings. She said she can't. Let me get back. You said something. There she go, LaShawn Terry. What you say about fake jury? What? What'd you say? Let me. Because, baby, I was finna get... <laughs> baby, she been making me... I been want to get her all alive. <laughs> I been want to get her all alive. <laughs> I been let her make it. <laughs> I don't know what she was saying. <laughs> but I... My reacher, I been want to get her all... <laughs> okay let me get back <laughs> okay so here <laughs> oh the butt reacher baby she gonna have me getting the butt reacher <laughs> i've been letting her make it all live <laughs> money or fashion or or fa <laughs> okay 
I don't, I don't know what she mean, man. <laughs> I, I don't know. She just said fake. You guys know I'm dealing with all these people saying DH gay. And when I saw that, I just freaked. I just was like, oh, no, I got to get her. I got to get her. So <laughs> here it is. Let me help this lady so I can get off this line. Because <laughs> I'm about to get the reacher. So this right here. So we have a subby. She wants to sell the Palm Springs Mini for the mini bum bag. <laughs> you guys know I laugh and play over here. Don't take me serious. LaShawn, I'm not serious. If you new here, no. <laughs> if you are new here, guys, I know I play all day. I play all day. I love to laugh and have fun. That's That's just how I do. I, I know exactly what she meant. I was just playing with her. That's that's just how I play, guys. <laughs> I don't take anything to heart. LaShawn, we cool. We cool. We cool. We cool. Okay? I promise. I was just playing. So, which one? <laughs> I know. We cool, sis. I was just, I just joke a lot over here. Okay. So, which one should she go for? So, should she sell her backpack and go for the mini bum bag? What do you guys think? Which one would you go for? Of course, the mini bum bag is bigger. Me, uh, The Palm Springs backpack is bigger. Palm Springs mini. No, don't be scared. That's why I was like, you, you, you have to be new. I play all day. No, she doesn't have both. She wants to sell the mini so she can purchase. I mean, she wants to sell. Both of them are mini. I keep saying the mini. She wants to sell the Palm Springs mini so she can purchase the mini bum bag. Which one should she do? What should she do? <laughs> People, you crazy. Okay just sell i'm telling you if you want to get this i was up i wake up at 4 30 in the morning every morning you you can catch this i, I post in my stories you can catch this okay so you said you never use your palm springs okay that's true hmm the mini bum bag is online it was online this morning. At, it was from 4.30, I think, to 8 a.m. That's when it sold out. I announced it in my stories. Guys, this mini bum bag is tough. I don't care what anyone say. This shook up my 2023. I was so surprised, and I am so happy. I was like, I was going to pass on this. I didn't pre-order. My CA said, Marquita. I cannot believe we have one that came in. I was like, are you serious? She said, Marquita, it's, it's so many people that want this. I'm telling you, take the mini bum bag. And you know how, you know how those CAs are. I, I'm always like, okay, if you want to sell, just say you need to sell. And she was like, Marquita, it's not like that. It's no, this is not permanent. This is going to be gone in November. You know what? Now that you know. Good night, Lorraine. Now that you know, this is not a permanent piece. You guys give me to say, I'm not talking anymore. I'm getting off. Bye, Lorraine. Good night. So this is not. The high-rise bum bag is not a permanent piece. The mini bum bag is not a permanent piece. Okay? Yeah, guys. Ooh. Okay? This is leaving us. This is leaving us, okay? Yes, that's fine. It really doesn't take two to three weeks. Well, some people, it does. Some people, it, it does. I've been hearing people get theirs in five days. It just depends on where it's shipping from. One young lady, she's a VIC. She's in my group, in my um, Marquita LV Luxury private Facebook group. 
she said that they are shipping them to the u.s they're not being manufactured but they are shipping from one location to the u.s i'm not sure how i'm not sure how true that is but she said as of right now you can't even order through a ca but my ca been working magic yeah guys it's it's out it's it's not a permanent piece so i'm glad that you guys know it's some things that i'm really not supposed to say and i just try to be loyal but that that was a spill that was a spill okay no we're not taking a peek because we don't have letty like that letty is checking on property in florida due to the hurricane and i didn't want to do it without her Took about two weeks, so the smooth microfiber material. I saw I wake up at 4 30. So it could have been on there earlier than that. When I checked, it was on there at 4 30. I took a screenshot, but I got busy. I posted it in my stories. I think it was around seven o'clock, and by eight o'clock it was gone. So I think two people, when I posted on Instagram, two people were able to order. So I felt good. I was like, hey, my job is done. Okay, you know what? I always check. Where was this made? <laughs> it was made in Italy. I'm like, hold on. No, we didn't do the picture. We are going to wait next week till we have Letty. Check on Sundays, Monday, and Thursday. I've been kind of seeing a pattern. Sunday, Monday, and Thursday. Okay. You got yours at 9.30? Great. No, I don't. I didn't get the high-rise bum bag because I have the OG. I don't like the creases in the front, the canvas, and I don't like how light it is. So, no. I'm okay with this. I love the, uh, um, the original. And, guys, this had a lot of water spots, but you see how the patina is setting in? If you can look close. You see the water spots now? yep this is the og so the patina is coming in and so that's why i don't worry about the water spots i love for it to just do its thing guys i just love for it to do its thing i don't spray with apple guard i just let it age gracefully so i've been having this for years and i just let it age i just let it do its thing so okay that's what i do and this bum bag I really, really would love to use it a lot more, but I don't. I wish I could basically use a lot more. Letty. <laughs> Letty been popping up. <laughs> Letty, I canceled the whole monogram bum bag. I thought you were gone. <laughs> I thought you was gone, girl. Mm-mm. Uh -uh. I wake up at 4 30 why i check the website i don't know but i try to post it on my instagram stories every time <clears throat> so but this is super nice i'm in the drive-thru lane <laughs> oh man lady you something else okay Y'all, I have a class in the morning. So, which one do you guys like the best? Yes, the mini bum bag. I I'm telling you, every time I catch it, I try to, I'm telling you. Thank you so much, LaShawn. Yes, we got to be online. I have to be on my Zoom. The OG. The YSL. I don't know. I'm still. I am going to do like my fall. My fall collection. Like some of my clothes from fall is in. And I'm going to match like my handbags. 
I am going to do an entire haul, like all of my fall clothes so you guys can see, okay? All of my fall clothes. Oh, thank you. Where is it? Y'all, I use this as an anklet too. I put this around my ankles. <laughs> I haven't seen the YSL bum bag. Sis, do you have any Gucci joggers? No, I do have a Gucci. You know what? I wouldn't consider that jogger. It probably is a jogger set. I do have a Gucci set though. And I you I wore it one time. Yep, I have a jogger set. So what pissed you off? What are you guys talking about? <laughs> what pissed you off? Y'all just be having... Oh, yeah. It's just there for decor. My favorite LB bag. My favorite LB bag would be... Uh-uh. Uh-uh. It's too many. Of course, the loop gym. The side trunk. This right here, you guys think I'm playing. This this stole my heart. This stole my heart. But I'm done with small bags. And then, of course, my passy. My passy handbag. But it's too many. I can't. It's too many. I'm not a I'm not a real big fan of the Palm Springs Mini. I love, I love that, you know, with it being, you know, with it being so small, it still holds you know, a lot, but I, I don't just reach for it. I don't reach for it. My favorite bum bag is the mini bum bag. It's the mini bum bag. It most definitely is the mini bum bag. My favorite bum bag is the mini bum bag. Out of these two. It's the mini bum bag. Like. The mini bum bag is, I love that it holds both of my phones. And I love how it goes around my waist. I just love everything about it. You see how these are two different handbag straps, okay? These are two different monogram straps from two different bags. I love it. Guys, this is dope. This is is dope this is treated vachetta i had to look at it again you see how they just lay y'all this is dope this is dope i love it you guys need this you see how that just lays it's so cute you guys need the mini bum bag you need it. Yes, the strap is treated Vachetta. And it also comes with a chain strap as well. Okay, you see me? Have your... Um, I keep everything... Guys, I get asked that a lot. The number one way to keep the inside of your handbags clean, use the mini pochette, use the toiletries. If you have the toiletry 15, if you have the toiletry 19, put those items inside of those toiletries. Use the mini, me, the, uh, the, the, poch the pochette, the mini pochette. Use those items. That's what they are here for. Don't just go placing pins in your bags. I had that happen to me inside of my Neverfull and a pin busted. You have to utilize those mini pochettes, those toiletries. Even the cosmetic bags, damage, damage those things, okay? Those are small. Damage those, but don't damage the inside of your bag. You just have to utilize them or get an organizer. But I love, like, the toiletry is behind you. What small bag? Oh, I showed this. This was gifted to me from my CA. This was the first thing that I showed. A lot of you guys probably wasn't even on live. 
but and I haven't used this at all but it's so cute but I haven't used it yet so utilize those those items those little small toiletries and things like that okay would be too small but it looks awesome on you thank you so much no i was i was worried as well i just knew and guys it like it stretches this is the toiletry as this is a toiletry as well guys it's just a different color and it's an unprunt leather so for you guys that are kind of new to the lv community this is a toiletry 26 because of the size it comes in not in this actual color or um material in the canvas it comes in a 15 a size 15 19 and a 26 okay being the largest size my 26 i lease that out i let people you know some people like to use it you know when they go to the club you know those women that have it for the boutique so some of the boutiques you see on instagram guys that is my toiletry 26 i lease that out i lease it out to boutiques like every weekend so for their photo shoots that's what they use that's just like a prop okay so this is a size 26 in unprunt leather and this is a scarlet red okay And so, yes, I do lease out, like, my like my clutch, my YSL clutch, I do lease that out. And my Toiletry 26, I keep that in heavy rotation. It's just another way to just bring in extra income because I don't use those. So, I lease them out, have a contract, lease them out, they do a deposit, and that's it. Okay. I'm still head over heels. I love these so much. I can't wait oh, for my flight. I'm wearing these. Okay, so guys, any questions? I have the mini bum bag. I showed you guys that. I showed you some of my travel. I showed you guys my LV boots already. Um, I don't know what else. I showed you guys everything. My travel luggage. For those that emailed about my reverse monogram, I showed you guys that. And probably next video. Oh, and I'm finna get off of live. You came late. Okay, my next video, I might go over like my, my perfume collection, my LV shades, and probably like my bandos. And teach you guys how to tie um your bandos. Okay? So... Guys, this was a long live. I was not expecting to be on live this long. <laughs> but you know what we do when the besties link up. Okay. So, guys, I'm going to get off. I have a house full of boys. Yes. Okay, let me tell you what King did before I get off. He grabbed all of his clothes. I told him to clean up his room. He grabbed all of his clothes, even clean clothes. He grabbed everything and put them in a washing machine. And then he dumped a lot of detergent in there. And then he cut the, the thing on, on hot. And guys, I was like, bro, bro, come on now. Like, I don't, my appliances, I invest money, money into my appliances at my house. This boy put every color of the rainbow I tell them don't touch don't don't touch that don't play with my don't play with my refrigerator and don't play with my washing machine and my dryer and you know what I'm just sitting up here thinking I think he hurry up and cleaned up his room because he knew he was going to invite kids over I'm just putting two and two together and then let me tell you about my daughter before we get off she came my daughter she came and asked me for $2,000. Oh, yeah, everything's okay. She asked me for $2,000. Who she think I am? <laughs> Who do she think I am? 
She asked for two thousand dollars. Two thousand. So I'm like, for what? Why do you need? <laughs> Let me tell you. So she works for the family business. She gets paid. She works for the family business. She took some of her money and went and bought a Fendi crossbody. Oh, she does work. She works. She went and bought her a Fendi bag. No, no, she bought it. No. No. I went. <laughs> she asked. Guess why? She showed me her Zara cart had $2,000 of clothes from Zara sitting in the cart, $2,000 worth of clothes to match her Fendi bag. You know what? I'm I'm I I'm done. I just got mad all over again. Why did you buy the bag? Why you didn't buy the clothes first, girl? <laughs> she went. She did it backwards. She went about the bag first, and then went shopping for the clothes. So now you walking around with a bag and don't have no clothes to match the bag. I told you, you, you supposed to buy the clothes first. Yes, in Zara. Yep. She did it backwards. $2,000 from Zara. $2,000. Baby, she was trying to secure the bag. No, just wait till your next paycheck. Wait till you get paid again. <laughs> I most definitely did. I created the, the worst type. I don't know who's who's the, the biggest monster, her or King. They're both monsters. I just don't know which one is the biggest. Yeah. Yeah, but she she bought her own Zara bag, guys. It was $2,200. Me, her own Fendi bag. She bought it on her own. So, I was happy about that. She used her own paycheck. And she bought her bag. But she should have bought her clothes. So, now she got that Fendi bag with no clothes to match it. <laughs> well, I helped her with a few. With a few outfits. She's 16. Even 16. Mm-hmm. How do I lease my bags out? I type up a contract. And they can lease by day. They can lease hourly. Or they can lease basically the weekend. Yeah, so I do. I have to teach her a little bit, some, some things. But she wasn't going for that tail far bag. <laughs> that tail far bag. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Yeah, she'll know now. Like I said, I got her a few. I did pay her for a few. I didn't do the two thousand. She has she has to do that on her own. If that's the way you want to shop, you want to shop from Zara, go ahead. But we love going to Goodwill. Like we go to Goodwill together. Like we love going to Goodwill. Like she like she wants to start painting on her jeans, putting patches. So we go to Goodwill as well. I love going to Goodwill with her. So, yeah. She's the only girl. She's in the middle. And when I tell you, she is super spoiled. She is super spoiled, guys. It's crazy. Yep. She, I saw it with my own eyes. $2,000. I was like, whoa. My girl. Slow down. Slow down, my girl. You're doing too much. Which one is this? Y'all, you know what? Guys, you know what? I'm going to get off of here.
Do you guys see that? The cash app? King? Y'all, I gotta get off of here. Y'all see that? The cash app request from King? You know what? I I'm finna get off. Because the way these kids setting up here, the they robbing me blind and I'm on live with y'all. Let me get out so I can control my account. Because, you know what? Let me get a belt. I need to get a belt too. Because it's going to be some CPS calling. I am gone. <laughs> this boy here, man. Yeah, bro. Y'all see that cash out real <laughs> You're right. Let me go get these kids, y'all. I love y'all. I'm gonna go. Let me get the kids. Let me, let me, let me go get these kids. Cause they about to drive me nuts. <laughs> I love you guys. Thank you so much for chilling with me. As always, stay safe. <laughs> stay blessed. Until next time. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> yes, the belt. <laughs>